Hey guys, today I'm reviewing the Gardner GX1 boots. I needed some new boots for quite some time actually. Uh, I was looking for some boots that had some good quality to price ratio, uh, but I ended up not buying any. My girlfriend gave it to me as a Christmas gift, uh, unexpectedly, uh, but these ones are clearly spot on, and I didn't even know that this model existed. First things first, when you look at the boot, you don't see any chunky bits uh, coming off the boot uh, or anything that would grip on the boot where you're actually not expecting, whether it's your bike or your surroundings, so you have a really slick design on the boot. Second of all, and probably the thing that I like the most about these boots, just by trying them out the first time, are the buckles and the straps. The straps allow some rotation on the inside and that gives you a way better adjustment of the boots to your foot. You feel your foot way more connected to the boot than in regular boots. Besides, these metal alloy buckles feel quite reliable and durable and when they close, they close. Another thing are the soles. Since I got these boots, I pretty much only did hard enduro, so I've been riding on really harsh terrain and really rocky terrain, and considering the beating that I've been giving to them, they have been keeping up really well. They have minor wear marks, uh, which is a good thing, considering that these soles are not replaceable. I also really like this steel protection, and it's something that will make your boots last a lot longer. There are only two things I will consider improving on these boots. And the first one would be the stitching, namely on the right boot. I got a new bike and I can only start kickstarting it. And when you miss uh, kickstarting it, the kicks actually slams against the boot, and namely against the stitching. And you can already see some stitching starting to fail due to the repeatedly kicks hitting these parts and so I would recommend doing a stronger stitching or a reinforcement on this area uh, considering that. The second thing would be on the left boot uh, would be to insert a little padding, uh, a harder padding because well since I got them I already have quite some marks due to the shift lever and this would be perfectly avoidable if you had a harder padding on this on this area. To wrap it up, I would definitely recommend these boots if you're looking for something on the entry level range. If you have more experience with these boots, please share. And if you're thinking about getting these boots and you have other questions, feel free to get in touch. Thanks for watching and subscribe.